Hello and welcome. This is Gigi and this is a weekly tarot reading for my Scorpio sign. Hi Scorp. How are you babies? I think I've done a reading for you. It's been a while, maybe a month ago. You guys, I have relocated so um, I don't want you to worry about me. I know sometimes you Scorp worry about me. Uh, I'm also a Scorpio sun, but things are going good okay and you score you know that you know if you know about astrology there's a lot of work that we're doing in different areas of life but you know i say good because you don't want to say awesome and then people trying to find out how awesome it's it's it is and then you don't want to say bad because then you know you don't you, you want to be positive you don't want to be coming from this you know negative place but things are going better every day okay so that's the most important thing for you to know scorp and let's see what the message is this is a general reading three of cups in the reverse ace of pentacles and ace of wands in the reverse oh you're all about your coins right now money is big okay because I think you have a vision for for yourself and it's, it's changing right now okay um, it's depending of which area okay but there's an offer coming that's related to work there's something about work and self-employment okay um, I see ace of wands it's in a reverse so maybe um, you want you will not you may not feel like the timing is is good in order to start something and many offers are coming in with the ace of wands in the reverse clarify with the five of wands okay so score there's a lot of competition coming in at work for you you could be also starting a new job or something new going back to school or something like that because for me um, five of wands is also like my training student you know getting uh together with new people adjusting in a different environment uh people of different group age culture okay ace of wands isn't a reverse all right so you know right now even if you are observing some something that could be challenging in other people's life you may not be going through that yourself but you could see you could you could feel like there's you know something where you know your timing and other people timing is not at sync right now okay so it could be that maybe uh, in terms of teamwork maybe the environment is is a little hostile right now in you working with others all right with this ace of pentacles i do see you really being able to involve yourself in some type of uh creative project you'd be surprised how you could actually increase your income ace of pentacles here i feel that it's something that you will invest into and there's going to be different sphere in your life where you'll see huge improvement the first thing that comes to my mind that i'm see that i'm seeing here is health all right so maybe you always wanted to i don't know uh become a vegan and you never had really the setting for you to involve yourself in that or maybe you want to study this or you wanted to have you have a like a third angle something where you want to dive uh deep into and you have this opportunity to make it a, as an income all right uh very good uh but also three of cups in a reverse wow score most of your time right now is going to have to be spent alone or i i see three of cups in a reverse not a lot of support it's it's interesting while you're shining in your career or a different area of life Will of Fortune in a reverse court, would you believe that I do feel that you have some like envious people around you in your group or circle? Or maybe that will be the competitive environment that you're about to get into. I feel that some people may not have that solid, strong, maybe um, foundation for their new beginning. Because I do feel that because there's a lot of new beginning I have ace of pentacles and ace of wands in a reverse so if it's not your new beginning you may be witnessing someone else new beginning maybe in their venture they're not as stable or maybe not secure but will of fortune and uh in a reverse with three of cups in a reverse 
I feel it's just someone like really bringing you some type of shade in, in your work. Okay. Um, but then five of wands, this is a lot of competition. Maybe you're dealing also with people that have as much or even more experience or talent as you have. And maybe you're coming in very secure with the Ace of Pentacles. Um, let me let me look into this Five of Wands card. Ooh, King of Swords in the river in the reverse. Yeah, that's the hater. Oh, King of Swords in the reverse. Oh, this guy is so annoying. This is someone who always think about money. Is like he cares about nothing else than his own uh, betterment. King of Swords in a reverse, all right? So normally we see him in a in some type of a career position, okay? So be mindful here. I do feel that like if you're starting some something new, maybe because uh for some reason uh there's more uh awareness into your pat or your history and you're coming in with more eyes on you. With the King of Swords in the reverse, I feel like someone's going to, they're going to try to really be heavy. This King of Swords is, he's a hater. Okay. So like he has no reason. It's not going to why he would feel this way or why someone, sometimes people have no reason. Okay. They just, it's just, it's their own, they are bitter. Okay. And it's just the way it is. They, they like, they enjoy also seeing things or people in their worst way or they like triggering people and in, in making them feel a certain way and putting them on a spot or something like that i'm not sure but i've seen it at work okay so if it's a new environment uh just know that if you're happy to start something new just you might want to tone it down just for the next weeks if you're starting a new job or you're starting a, a, a school or something like that because I have someone of authority or someone who has some type of, uh, you know, visibility in that, in that group or, uh, project that is just, I feel like they're going to have, uh, their eye on you. And it's just King of Swords doesn't have to be, um, uh, a man. It could just be a really, a, like, you know, a very masculine woman especially at work we see them okay so be aware of this gorb okay so um that actually it's a good insight i'm going to look into the will of fortune in a reverse six of swords in a reverse and seven of pentacles all right so i do feel like there's something like with the six of swords in a reverse someone is definitely not ready to move on okay so from whatever issue they had in the past that, that seems to be related. It could be related to someone uh, in your family or someone that um, is a long a long time friend. I have seven of pentacles. All right, someone that you have known for a long time. All right, they seem to be having an issue with you moving on and you being able to uh, start something new with this ace of pentacles and to start something new in a very valuable way okay so it's like you're you you have an upgrade it's obvious that you're upgrading yourself or you have upgrading or you have been upgraded okay for some reason and for some reason this your friend circle network they're watching you right now and with the will of fortune in a reverse oh man they're so like because they're not at the same spot right now so you could have been behind people maybe a year ago like really trying to you know get yourself in a better place and now you're like you this is happening at this time today or you have pulled yourself out or it's obvious that you're you're elevated now or you are going to and they're just they can't believe it they're like six of swords in the reverse someone can move on they don't want you to move on to to uh, a better place or to better your place especially those are the people with the six of swords in a reverse like they knew that you've been through something like a storm or something that you're trying to leave behind and move on and it's in a reverse they don't want you to all right so be aware of this i'm going to look into the seven of pentacles sometimes somehow i should say this 
like it talks about something that you have been trying to do. It has some, something to do with your experience, but I have something with family or people that you have known. Could be, I don't know, I'm hearing it. Nary's? Ooh, something happening here. Let me look into the Seven of Pentacles for you, Scorp. Seven of Pentacles. The devil in the reverse. Scorp. <laughs> you have to laugh about that. Can't get rid of them. Man, so annoying, right? Scorpio with this uh with pluto being in capricorn as much as you want to leave and hide they see you you're on you're in the 10th house right now you're very visible or visible what am i saying you're very visible or you know you're very uh like you're expressing yourself or this you're vocal but the 10th house is a house where we see clearly what you do all right so you you have visibility in your career and so you can't escape that it does look like the devil here okay so it could be an aries i said aries but now i have to say with the devil it could be a capricorn all right so it's about your career investment be aware of this scorp all right so how did it will affect you i'm not sure but i have ace of pentacle here so that means you're making there's definitely an offer you're starting something new all right and something valuable and i, I could see that this is something that's going to last for a long time ace of pentacle clarify with the queen of pentacles you're definitely in your power at least in terms of your career and your ambition all right, so you're you're starting something new, but you're starting at an experience level. All right, so it's very gratifying for you, Scorp. I think there's a lot of jealousy with the devil here. Maybe there's a Capricorn who realize your experience, who who can see your advancement, and for some reason they're just maybe because that's the thing with Scorpio is like they when nobody's watching they make progression like it's slow but they are making progression where some other energies or some other placement in uh in the astrological belt have to put forward constant constant non-stop effort where you have some sign like i was saying scorpio where they would make that jump they would get that they will put the, all that energy and focus into a goal and make a jump and so maybe there's something about that because Wheel of Fortune in a reverse, like they really, they're not, some some other people around you are not able to make um, speculative, uh, like um, speculative, uh, uh, what is it, gains like you're making, like easily, like, okay, so I'm going to do this and I'm just going to randomly say, I'm going to invest this amount and this is what I'm going to expect in return doing this and that. And then that's a speculative, you know, uh, you know, vision. Some people, they, 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 they have to structure themselves a certain ways. And I'm talking about Capricorn. They need to think, think to be structured a certain way for them to be able to make growth where you're making bound with just having a different vision and adjusting so i guess you know and and maybe someone around you is uh just not really supporting so just with that you know move in silence like i was saying basically score because you're moving up right right here there's definitely a huge upgrade you're making you're feeling solid you're feeling strong and confident about your future in terms of your career looks really good i don't see much about love i have to say three of cups is in a reverse right i do see eyes on certain people and you know not enough support in really wanting to share or needing to share your advancement might as well just like i said you know keep it to yourself with this king of swords in a reverse court you know be mindful like in 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 anything that you're starting new example you're starting a new channel or you know you're dealing with a new uh party vendor for your business if you're doing business and you're speaking with someone on the phone or 
talking to someone in, on by email that don't want to help you and just you don't understand it so don't take it personal just understand that they may look at your account and be like oh maybe she's getting or he's getting too many things so i'm not gonna get him or i'm not gonna get him her what he or she could get okay you guys you understand right and so you don't get to then you don't have what you need but then maybe you could send an email instead you know what i mean so it doesn't have to be someone like some some type of you know opposition that you're gonna meet face to face but you're gonna sense maybe some uh lack of support in you wanting to move forward all right because ace of wands in a reverse okay so you may there's something that you may not be able to start at this moment too all right that it's in terms of a creative project all right but there's something that is solid where you will get some gain support or you're going to be able to have enough time or source to gain uh, something valuable that you needed in your life okay so i'm going to end this reading here for you my scorp let me know how this resonates with you please subscribe to my channel before you go like and share until next time send me lots of kisses i love you